Hello and welcome back with me, Red Gaming, on Farmer Simulator 19. So, just finished looking at all that. Um, obviously, the cultivating is getting done, which I might take over just to save a little bit of money. Let's uh, let's take over, save a bit of money, and then we can get the seed going whilst uh, get the beacons on as well. Yeah, whilst uh, this is getting done, we can uh, crack on. Then with the uh, well, once the seed is getting done, should I say, we can then crack on with the field um, to do the the hay, the hay and the bale of the rice. There we go, got there, I think. Yeah, that should be good. Got there's fine, hopefully we can get it all. We should be able to be each other that bit. Yeah, we can, good. Okay. So let's crack on with this. Bear with me when it comes to uh, Twitch chat because I can't actually see it. So I'm trying to flick out back and forth to the Twitch chat so I can actually see it. Um, okay. Neff, one, two, three. Are you, I wonder if you're subscribed to anybody else. Are you subscribed to uh, any of the other farming simmers? I don't even know what we, what would you call them, farming people. <laughs> I have no idea. Okay, that was me whilst I just tapped out. Just uh, I used the weapon to turn around there. So let's. Uh, Get rid of them again, let's crack on. Hopefully we can finish up here in short order. Obviously we eventually do need to get a bigger tractor as well, but at the moment what tractors we have are perfect at the moment. Massey Ferguson's definitely taken up quite a lot of the strain uh, due to the fact that it has the most horsepower. I'm looking into upgrading the case um, from the case that we have at the moment to potentially the case Puma, um, that will put it over 200 horsepower, potentially could get a couple of engine upgrades, um, that will put us hopefully quite high 200s, uh, if that be the case it means then we can use then the case to do, how many times did I just say case, well, it means we can use that then to use to do the cultivating as well, so it's not all bad on the, on the Massey to do it all, uh, because obviously as you can see, we haven't had him at near, nowhere near as long as the case yet. He's racking up the hours um, in terms of the usage wise, just because he's got the most power. So he's the only one that can do all this cultivating and stuff like that. So having another tractor that could potentially do it then, it definitely will uh, save a lot of time. Um, we could potentially even just get another, another cultivator as well. Um, we could get another one of these cultivators, not that expensive, but again, this is a, this is our future. This is when we have multiple fields uh, and stuff like that. So at the moment, we're not really too worried about them. Uh, I'm looking into getting chickens. Uh, I think they'll be interesting. I want to get um, quickly to have uh, If we, I want to get uh, not a car. What would it be under? Um, is it one of them? Nope. It's not a telehandler, maybe, nope. What would it be under? I think it normally goes there. I don't think I have access to them. Uh, is it in this, maybe? I doubt it, but I'm looking for, it's like a, it's like the uh, the John Deere Gator, obviously I don't have the John Deere Gator, but there was another one that you can get. Uh, and it's actually faster than the John Deere Gator. Maybe I have to download it. I'd, I am very, I'm unsure on that, 
Um, but the next track that we want to get is so at the moment we have the Maxis series. That's what we have at the moment. Uh, so we could look into getting a Puma. Puma series is a little bit more expensive than the Massey. Uh, it comes with a base of slightly more. Uh, however, we can get it upgraded to a 270 uh, if we wanted to. Alternatively, we can just hold out the money and then just get a John Deere. 280 standard, get it upgraded to the 50R, 300, and that will do us. It's only 10 grand more, so 238. Wheelbase wide, so yeah, a couple of grand more. Get a front loader attachment, yeah. Get a front load attachment, which would be obviously handy. Get the wide wide wheels, and uh, yeah, so you get twins as well. But get get the wide wheels, 241 and a half. It's quite expensive, so obviously we need to uh, save off that. But that gives us a 300 horsepower track there as well, uh, and that'd be obviously very handy. If not that, then obviously then we're going into the large tractors, which we get seven R. So get seven R. This this goes up a lot. <laughs> like seven three ten. I mean, even this could potentially be a better option. So two four one was the other one. Yeah, this fully upgraded with three hundred and fifty. Like what's this standard? I mean that. It's just, yeah. So we get three ten. Don't really want that. It doesn't car have a front loader on it though, um, but that's okay. 352 horsepower, 279,000 altogether. Um, but that'll give us a really, really powerful, strong track tractor. Uh, alternative, obviously, the, they have the 7R, they obviously have bigger ones than that as well. Um, we could go for the Opt, Opton one. Uh, 288 is standard, 3, 313, if we upgrade it, which is not great. For the price, it's not that good. The John Deere is still worth it. Um, going into really expensive now. The Massey, 300 standard, 350. I mean, that's worth it. 350 is a lot more. 400, wow. That would be a lot more. Fair, 300 grand though. I mean, that's a massive tractor. And then you're going into like the realms of 8R then, which is like, 290 standard but I'm pretty sure that goes to 400 and something yeah 450 horsepower as a but it's a really really expensive tractor and then yeah you go into challenger room going into the big boys then quad tracks and stuff like that which they're late game we definitely do not need one of them Valtra maybe 350 That'd be a decent one to get. Uh, 87. I think the 87 is actually quite a good option. Because if you do 50, 300 grand, you get 400 horsepower, which is more than anyone else. Um, so what about the 70? Is that. They seem to underpower the um, the New Holland tractors, seem very underpowered. Um, I don't know why. But they, that Massey seems definitely a good option, the 8700 series. Um, so let's. Let's get rid of the work here, let's finish this bit. That'd be a, I think that would be a really good option. I mean, that's 300,000 now. I think we definitely want to do new combine harvester before we even think about getting a new tractor. Yeah, the combine harvester will definitely be the next on our agenda. But yeah, overall, it's not too bad. Should be able to do one more pass and then we can get... Obviously, we'll finish up on the other side that he missed, and then we should be good to uh, start seeding. We can start seeding this side of the field first. We don't obviously have to do the other side. But as we're cultivating the other side, we can start seeding on this side. So let's just uh, get right in the middle here. We should be good. I mean, saying now this is a 300 horsepower cultivator. And we seem to be pulling it. I mean, we're only 280, and we seem to be pulling it pretty, pretty fine, if I'm honest. No real issues when it comes to pulling it. Even on this like big hill. I mean, this is like a pretty big hill, so we don't really have an issue with pulling it up the hill either. 
and then obviously on the other side it's, it's even better so so just crack you there for now you head over there you unfold and you're gonna plant canola I think let's just have a quick look at the prices canola they're on the way back up soybeans are really goddamn expensive still but canola's on its way back up so I think canola is probably a good option it's definitely not a bad option to go for uh, but as you can see, oats are pretty good in price. Soybeans are really, really good in price. The yields are crap, but like in comparison to most others. But we'll go for canola because we haven't had canola in quite, quite a while. Okay, right. You go. You are finished. You let's go. Let's go do that last little bit that you've missed. Then we can start doing the uh, the different stuff for. Uh, did you get all that there? I think we did. Let's get right in the middle. Right, let's just finish up this little section. I don't know why they keep missing this. They always keep missing this one little tiny section. I'm not entirely sure why they keep missing this little section. Um, it's kind of baffling. But uh, yeah, they keep doing it. I'm just going to keep ignoring it and then just doing it myself, but I don't know why they keep doing it. And they keep missing the strip of the edge as well, the very, very edge. Keep missing that as well, which obviously we'll need to do. But, like I say, it's quite an easy fix, so it's not too bad. Luckily, our, like I say, our cultivator is pretty wide, so it doesn't take us very long to do it. That is uh, definitely a bonus. There's that. Finish that up. Okay. Right, spin round. So much luck we can do. Let's go down this part. And then this should be us. That's the entire field then. We could expand the field a little bit more, uh, make it a few more rows wider, but I think I'm just going to cut it and make it turn into grass, uh, or just use the grass, and then we can bale it up as well and then turn it into uh, hay or silage, which is most likely what's going to happen, turn it into silage. Um, obviously, we need to go back to the other field very soon so we can uh, start baling now because we don't want to waste any. I want to turn that into money as fast as possible. The good thing about the grass as well is, to be honest, if I <laughs> recommend to anyone, if you want to start out any game, just uh, buy a combine. Buy it. If you don't want to, it's, it's a really quick and easy way to start and get money. Is uh, In fact, let's go that way. If you want to get money really quick um, without having to buy a combine harvester and everything like that, do silage. Literally just get a mower, buy a mower instead of uh, buying anything else. Buy the mower and uh, yeah, do silage because silage you get a lot of money for. And that's not, even, I'm not even joking when I say that. You get a lot of money when you're doing silage. That wasn't very straight, was it? Okay. That should do. Well there good okay so if we grab the baler which is already over there which is great news looks like the field is already started to grow back as well and like I say when it comes to the uh, the grass when you obviously plant the initial grass but uh, after that it's completely free because it just keeps growing and then grows again it grows again so yeah, you don't have to worry about it. It just keeps growing. So yeah, it's really, it's really, really good. If I'm honest, it's a good thing to go for. Um, and then just lease the wrapper every time you do it because you'll make the money back anyway. So you may as well just lease, lease the wrapper every time you do it. You'll make the money back and obviously an extra 
probably 20, 30,000, depending on how much grass you do. Like, for example, if we did the other field, like field 21, if we turned all of that into grass, for example, we'd be making an absolute fortune in terms of uh, the amount of uh, grass bales and stuff like that. Turn both of these into grass bales. It's, I, I understand it, obviously, it will be a little bit tedious, a little bit boring, because it's the same thing. It's just grass. But silage is definitely a money maker in this game. Uh, I don't know whether they need to like dump that down a tiny bit, but um, it's definitely a good thing to go for if you're just starting out. Do a bit of grass. You don't need to buy anything else other than a cedar, a mower, tether, windrow, stuff like that. Probably not even not even a tether if you're not going to do hay. You may as well just get a windrow, and then that's all you need. Lease the wrapper, or even buy the wrapper at the start of the game. You'll probably be able to afford it anyway. And then literally just do uh, do silage to start with until you got like maybe a couple of a couple of million under your belt then you can then start thinking about right then get a harvester then get this then get that uh, but at the start of the game you, yeah you just don't need that sort of stuff so well unless you're gonna obviously do what I'm doing which is obviously harvesting crops and stuff like that but looking back if you just wanted some quick easy money um, grass is definite silage do silage just do silage it's just so so easy you could even buy the biogas plant for like or the tile for it for like 600 grand buy one field one big field like the, even this small field and then for the time being there's like 800 grand gone but you only need one tractor that could be able to pull this hard this baler anyway so it doesn't really make that much of a difference. Should be able to get a fair decent amount of uh, grass bales out of this thing. <coughs> Excuse me. Terrible cough. Okay, you uh, stop the lift you up so you shouldn't be picking any of this up. because I want to keep the hay I don't want to use any of the hay up just yet I'm going to go around, I'm going to cut the edges of the fields as well, we're going to use that grass as well um, because we need to get at least a full trailer out of this if we don't get a full trailer then it's not really worth it um, so we do well it is worth it because it's still worth a lot of money but ideally we do need to get a full trailer out of it what I am going to do is I'm just going to keep this attached though and run the, uh, run the mower at the exact same time as this is running. So if we go to the end here again, pick you up, spin you around. You should be able to come down here, like so. There we go. Let's finish this last little bit. There's some bits at the top of the headland as well, which I'll, I'll get. But... Um, quite a bit on the on this section they like say I did cut all of this so it should be quite a bit let's get some of this headland stuff I don't mind it doesn't really matter if we pick it up all right now we can obviously just come back and get it later I do want to try and get this last full bale though which is why I want to okay get out of the way I just stood it up which is kind of weird Okay, nearly there. I just want to get this one last full bale. Okay, there we go. We are going to use uh, grass anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Right, let's take you off a second. Let's uh, unload you. There should be two bales coming out of that. Let's have a quick count of how many bales we have. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10. So we've got 10 bales so far. Let's go grab the uh, the mower. And then we're going to go across the uh, other section of the field. We need to get, obviously, another uh, 6 more bales worth to make it really, really worth it. So let's go grab. Let's turn that on. 
his turn. Yeah, he's got to turn it off for now. I didn't think it needed to be on. So yeah, we're going to go back and forth on this part of the field. There we go. Go in here. That's fine. Uh, lower. Uh, lower. Come on. Turn on. I'm going to skip to that. I'm going to turn you on as well. And then uh, I can't see a thing. So let's go into the side. There we go. Hopefully, this should pick it up automatically, like straight away. We shouldn't. Should be able to see now. Shouldn't be leaving anything. Yeah, it's picking it up straight away, which is good. I'm just going to do from the inside of the track there, because I think it'll be slightly easier. But yeah, this is uh, definitely a good way to make money. We need to try and get another, like I say, another six bales out of uh, the sides of these fields. But that shouldn't be too hard to do. I wouldn't have thought. And with the uh, the baler right behind, we should be able to uh, just basically keep going round in square, or giant squares or ovals or whatever you want to call them. I don't want to go too close to the trees, obviously. I don't want to use all, like, every little last piece up, but... We do want to get the majority of it. Uh, that should be about... Let's see if we can make it up this hill. <laughs> I'm not sure whether we will be able to, but we'll see. This could take us a little bit, actually. Could take us a little while to go around all of these uh, this, this headlands. But we should be good. Should be should get us a fair number of bales though, which is good. It's quite a lot of grass, so and all needs cotton. All needs cotton in the end anyway. So uh, we're gonna go all the way down here. Luckily, we got the baler on the back, so it is picking it up automatically. Otherwise, this would kind of be a pain in the ass to go round with it uh, at the end. Hopefully, we can make it up this bloody hill. Come on. Need to somehow get rid of these trees as well. Maybe not the ones on this side, but definitely on the other side. They're a bit, <laughs> bit of a pain in the ass. Okay. Well, that's the uh, first pass. Done. They say this might take a little while. The seed is nearly done as well, though. That's good. Well, we should get quite a lot of bales from this thing. We should get quite a lot. Oh, missing bits. We don't want to miss any bits. Yeah, it looks like he's on his last pass, the uh, the cedar, which is uh, really good. I haven't seen a bale yet. Like, where'd they go? They're coming out yet? They seem to be going in. Seems like quite a bit. I feel like I've done loads, but I haven't I haven't drove past a bale yet, have I? I, think, I can't remember seeing one. Pretty much on the field edge now as well. On this side, anyway. Well, I don't think I've drove past the bale yet. Oh, the cedar might have destroyed it, though, I guess. Maybe he's drove over it or something. Oh, there's one. That's okay, then. Looks like they're all on this side of the field. Uh, there's there's one anyway. Let's see if we can see any others on the way down. I hope we can. I hope we have more than the one. It's quite a lot of grass, so I should think so. Definitely think so. Oh, there's another one. That's good.
Oh, struggling. It's quite a steep part of the section, though. No? It's quite a steep section, so it's struggling a little bit to get up there. Yeah. Uh, yeah. If I'm honest, I'm probably going to do this from now on. I don't know why I didn't think about this from now, like from the start. Uh, this is so so much easier. Just drag both of them at the same cotton, cotton. Do it at the same time. So much, so much easier than doing uh, what I've been doing and cut everyone and then windrow and edit and blah blah blah. This is a lot easier. I don't know why I didn't think of this from the start. There's another one. So we've already got. We should get quite a few bales out of this. Um, right, he's going to have to move. So. Let's uh, fold him up. He's planted this field as well, which is obviously great news. Um, yeah, that's that's really good news for us. Uh, let's get him out the way. We've still got quite a lot of seed left as well, which is good. Yeah, it's really, really good. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay. Let's park him up because we don't need him for right now. He can get going with the fertilizer though, whilst we carry on with the uh, seeding. Uh, not the seeding, the uh, grass cutting. So he, he can go grab the fertilizer. I can never get him in perfectly straight the first time. It's kind of annoying. Come on. That'll do. Right, you grab the fertilizer. Case is definitely doing a lot of work this episode. It's normal saying that though, it's, it is normally the master doing all the work, so kind of. For God's sakes, my driving is horrendously bad today. Come on. Okay, let's go around, let's do unfold, I'm going to guess around the belt here-ish, like maybe there, I think that is actually pet. oh no it's not, <laughs> okay belt maybe here. Let's raise it up and such. Right, you crack on. Right, you everything turn on. Again. Good. Right, let's go. Let's crack on with these uh, last probably one more ground. Then we should be up should be pretty good. That should get us probably just over a uh, trailer actually as well. Which would be good. The only problem is we've got to wrap them and wrapping them takes forever. Wrapping them definitely takes a quite a while. It's kind of annoying. It's very annoying. So yeah, if you do have any friends that want to uh, come and join the channel, then please do let them know. Um, Hand them over, head them over to the, the channel either on Twitch or YouTube. Introduce them to the Discord. I already have two people over there at the moment. One's uh, Amy Leon and her friend Mammoth, I think it is. Mammoth or something like that. Um, so, yeah, we have a couple of decent conversations over there on the Discord channel every now and again. Uh, I obviously post there when we do go live and stuff like that as well. So, it's obviously a good. Good thing to keep uh, interactive with, should I say. Uh, it's re really useful uh, for, for myself personally. It's really useful to uh, obviously contact any viewers or subscribers, stuff like that. So I would recommend heading over to that if you want to keep up to date with what's going on 
terms of the channel, in terms of streaming, mainly streaming to be honest. Uh, but we can have obviously a, any decent conversations over there as well. Just uh, pipe up and let, uh, let us know what you want to talk about. I can give you hints and tips to do with uh, the farming if that's what you want. Alternatively, we can just have a chat. So, completely up to you. Right, one more round. I'm going to finish up the top end behind us. And uh, we'll go get the uh, go get the wrapper, and then we'll go around and uh, do the wrapping of all of these bales. Uh, I'm looking at the bales; they're probably probably going to come into about maybe about 20 bales altogether, 20 low 20s maybe. Uh, so that would be really really good though. Uh, do this last little bit; here. it's fine. Should be able to get all that. He's doing the fertilizer. We need to go there and get a new fertilizer. Because I don't think he'll be able to do the next one on that one. So we'll have to go grab some more fertilizer. And then we can speed time up. And then we've got another harvest to do. Hopefully by the end of this uh, stream. But as you can see, this is obviously dedicated quite a lot to uh, doing some silage. Uh, cutting grass, doing some silage. And yeah, we should be uh, should be be able to rake in some some money. I'm gonna cut all this bit of grass as well, so I'm gonna go around and pretty much go around in circles, uh, or go back and forth for the uh, the next couple of passes. I do want to cut all this grass. So, oh yeah, it's uh, pretty good so far got quite a few bales off uh, doing headlands which is obviously exactly what I wanted let's just uh, go over all of this bit hopefully it doesn't drop any of the bales right in front of where he's uh, fertilizing because that'll be a pain in the ass Obviously, with it being Christmas next week, I hope everyone's looking forward to uh, to that next a week tomorrow. Tomorrow, yeah, a week tomorrow, Tuesday next week. Hope everyone's looking forward to uh, Father Christmas coming. Santa Claus. Be very, very. Uh, hope everyone gets what they've asked for, or hope everyone gets as near to what they've asked for. Anyway, <laughs> you might not get exactly what you've asked for, but. I hope everyone gets pretty much what they've asked for, though. Um, it's a busy man. A lot, of, a lot of houses to visit and deliver to, so give them some slack. Make sure to put out your uh, your carrots and your mint pies or whatever else you you fe feed them, depending on what part. Oh God, should not have done that. Depending on what part of the. Uh, uh oh. Stop wasting my bloody fertilizer, you good. Well, that's just wasted loads of fertilizer, but the idiot. Kind of my fault, not gonna lie. Definitely was 100% my fault. Uh, oh, for God's sakes. Thank you, one. I only meant to click, uh, to <laughs> turn the power off. Jesus. Absolutely messing this up. Let's have a look, see where we've been. Like, there's quite a lot of grass on this bit, to be fair. So we might have two full loads worth. Um, if we do, then that'll be absolutely great. Um, we're going to need to go straight ahead, aren't we? Yeah. Turn that off. That's fine. Turn you back on. Let's do this last one. I've not got much else, much more to do now, to be honest, so it shouldn't take too long. I do want to stop you, though. You are not finishing that part of the field. Fold up. And then... Right, turn you back on, turn you on. 
go back to you. Turn you off. Swing around. Turn you back on. I should be able to finish off this bit of the field. Might have to do one more pass on it. Looks like we will. We have missed some bits, but not that many in the most, so it should be good. Yeah, it should be good overall, really. We haven't missed that much, really. Look, look, avoid all that. So many bales. Got quite a lot of grass bales, so done pretty well and again this is all free I mean we've, we've not grown any of this so this is all free for us we've not planted any of it we've not grown any of it so this is just free money other than obviously taking out the uh, the price of the wrapper and then the wrapper is only 2700 provided we only use it for an hour which I only imagine is using it for an hour should take it more than that I uh, can't see why it would take us any more than that. I'll go through that little gap there if I can. Push all this out the way. There we go. There we go. Last couple of bits. And yeah, it looks like we got quite a few bales out of this, which I'm so, so happy about. Um, if that be the case, that we should, should potentially be looking into getting about... Uh, 50, maybe maybe even 50,000 sort of range um, of terms of money wise because it should uh, should be quite good this is such a better idea with the uh, <laughs> the, the, the mower and the, uh, the baler this is such a good idea I'm so glad I thought about it beforehand um, so much more convenient now Turn her off. I don't want to ruin the path that I've played. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Just a little bit. Come on, power up, power, 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 power. There we go. And we're off. So we can speed up the time now if we want to. What we do want to do though now is uh, we just. I'm going to just jump there. I don't want to drive. So we're just going to go to the animal dealer. Go visit quickly buy a couple more horses so what do we have at the moment um we have a gray one so chestnut we haven't got one of them uh bay do we have a bay one i wish it told you what we had i think we do have a bay one seal brown we don't have one of them so let's get them as you can see we're up to 16 and stuff on most of them so let's get them two horses transportation fee because uh, we can't obviously afford to and that is a, that should be a full paddock so we confirm that and then we skip back to the mass uh, view fold up no fold that's kind of annoying that little bit of grass along the edge we might get rid of that as well but down here we have one two three four five five bales down there six seven on the other side and then we have up here, we have 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 in the back here, 13 in the back here, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. And then obviously we have the other 10 on the other field as well. So it looks like we have about um, 20, 20, 28. So if we can try our best and get another... If we can get another f six bales, um, I don't think we will be able to though, but if we could try and get another six bales, then that would be such a good result. Um, let's just go down here. Can, does this field need any... Right, look. So this field's now growing. Happy days. Uh, soil just needs fertilizing when we come to the second round, which is fine. Uh, so if we go and you, we can start speeding up the game a tad. And we can finish off these uh, these bales. I'm 
I'm hoping. If we have two loads worth, I'm hoping that brings in, I don't know, maybe 50,000. That would be absolutely amazing. Um, that would be really, really, really good for the farm. Because if we can get in about 50,000, we'll be back up to about 100 altogether. I don't want to obviously do the field. So it looks like they're growing in different stages as well, which makes no sense. They're all got planted at the exact same time. Uh, well, this side, oh, the, this side did technically get planted faster. Um, okay, it looks like. Are we gonna? Head back over there. It's quite a lot of grass. Um, is this. So is this going to grow? How long is it going to take to grow? It's in like two sections, which is kind of annoying. So that's in the stage one. Or the second stage. Let's head down here. And uh, do this little bit as well. I'm hoping that grows and then we can then fertilize the rest. Come on, what the hell? Taking the time to grow. It means it's going to grow at different stages when it comes to. Uh, oh, it's going to be in different stages when it comes to harvesting as well, which is kind of annoying. And luckily, so we turn that off, take you off, uh, raise you, raise you. Luckily, the uh, the it looks to me so we. Force them out. That should be two full bales, and we haven't got that much in it. So it's kind of annoying that there isn't much in it, though, because it means can can you get off? Fold. Get off. All right, let's go put this back. Get the uh, got at least the wrapper now, and then we can uh, wrap all of our stuff. So you you drop that. I need to keep this here anyway, so we'll just keep it next to it because we need to obviously take the hay up. The only problem is, like I say, it, the hay, we might not get that much hay because there's a tiny bit of grass left in it. And it does just, that's it, it just quantifies it all as grass, which is kind of annoying. Um, do, what do you need? You need the wrapper, so first of all, let's go to you. How much do you have in you? We just need the field to grow. So. We will. Uh, we wait until the field grows, I guess. Because there's nothing really else we can do. Here we go. So. Let's grow to its. I mean, that's on stage. The, the next stage and that's on its first stage but that should be okay we should be able to should be alright with that I mean we've got a crop tyres anyway so we're not going to damage anything which is good which is why I want to get the case to do this I don't know if we're going to have enough for the entire field um, I'm going to guess and say no but we can always we can always fill it up again so it's not too much of an issue. All right, let's head to the shop. We need to take out the uh, the, the wrapper, and then we can uh, wrap all of these grass bales. The hay. What I might do with the hay instead is I might just use the uh, auto. I'm, I'll just dump all of the hay, uh, not the hay, the straw in the uh, in the basically in the pen where it is at the moment. And then I will go round with the auto load, the loader picker up your thingy. So that's it. That's already in that growth stage, which is like the second growth stage. So it'll be start out like that. One, two, and then three. So it's in a second growth stage, and that's in its first. So that's kind of annoying. But there's nothing really we can do about it. So just going to have to let it 
let go like that. I'm going to just drift back to the chat to see if anyone's wrote anything. They have not, so it's a bit of a shame. Um, as for YouTube, you've been going for... Let's have a look. I think you've been recording for the past 40 minutes, so we should be okay to keep going for a little bit more. Yeah, recording for 45 minutes. Okay, so what we want to do now is we want to go to Bail Technology. Uh, where's Bail Technology? Bail Technology. I want to get this wrapper. Um, it's a bit of a pain in the ass constantly, but we're going to lease it. We're not going to keep it. it I mean, it's only 54,000. We don't even have that anyway, so we are going to lease it. So lease, yes. Okay. Should be behind us. It is. Okie dokie. Okay, there we go. Let's hook on here. 34,900, so 35 for all intents and purposes. Um, why is it so now? It's probably because of the wages, actually, thinking about it. But that's saying nothing. We have been doing stuff, so it's not the end of the world. Okay, so. Let's crack on with the uh, the wrapping of these bales. Quite a lot of bales to be wrapped, so definitely no time wasting. And they take for fucking ever to wrap up. So let's just line the next one up. Yeah, they definitely take their time wrapping these, um, and you can't automate it. This is something that you have to do on your own again. Um, bit of a pain in the ass, if I'm honest, but no oh well. You must do what you must do to get the money. Should be okay though. Uh, he should be fertilising. How much has he got left in him? Hundred, okay, should be fine. Come on, come on. Go in it. Uh, don't hit the tree. Blech. We've got that one on the main road as well. Oh yeah. The one nearly on the main road, should I say. It's not quite on the main road, but it's pretty much there. Oh, somehow stacked that. How have I done that? Get off it. Get off it. Oh, for God's sake, that's annoying. Oh, it's uh, highly annoying. Oh, fucking hell. Right, we'll just have to, I don't know, hit her or something in a minute. Come on. Thank you. Let's go down to this one. <coughs> Excuse me. Very sorry. I would mute the mic, but obviously it comes out of nowhere and I don't. I can't just. Headphones aren't that good. So, uh, okay. His tank is now empty, which he's done quite a lot of the field. So, let's go fill him up again. We do need to get cows. Um, cows are definitely be beneficial because I've said it before to do with the, uh, the manure, we can obviously use the manure spreader. They would definitely be beneficial, but for the time being, we can just keep going back and forth getting fertilizer. It's quite expensive though. Fertilizer is pretty expensive, and it only lasts, it only seems to last maybe um, one and a half fields worth. Um, so, yeah, it's pretty, pretty expensive for what it is. So, we definitely need to start thinking about getting cows or something, but cows again, the cows are just way too expensive. Fertilizer, buy. We could buy solid fertilizer, 
It's slightly cheaper. I don't know if you go through it any faster though. Um, I'm not entirely sure if you go through it faster or slower. Someone in the comments, please let me know. Because um, I'm not entirely sure. But yeah, that's it for YouTube. So don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. If you do like everything, make sure to check out my YouTube channel uh, for the other content. And make sure to check out Twitch. Uh, everyone watching on YouTube, bye-bye for now. And I'll see you next time. Thank you.